Mike, and we welcome you to our home. We love lounging in our living room, usually cuddling under a cozy blanket while reading a book or doing a crossword puzzle. So much natural light comes into this room, helps make it feel very bright and warm, and really makes it a nice room to enjoy activities in. Plus, our rabbit Ralph has his retirement condo here in this room, and it's such a comfort to know that he's here in this room with us when we're reading or doing a crossword puzzle. This is our family room. We spend the most time here where we entertain our family and friends, play board games, and watch our favorite TV shows and movies. We also open presents on Christmas Eve while enjoying the decorations and Christmas tree. In the winter, we get the room nice and toasty with a roaring fire. This is the spot in our house where we just relax after a long day of work or fun activities. On nice warm sunny days throughout the year, you can find us in rocking chairs on our front porch, usually listening to 70s or 80s music while enjoying a cup of coffee or an ice cold drink. We've had some incredible conversations in these chairs. We've helped each other overcome obstacles, solve problems, and maybe most importantly, encouraged each other throughout our lives. On top of that, we've got some incredible neighbors, and they've come over as well. Mike takes great pride in keeping our lawn green, mowed, and well taken care of. I prune the bushes, trees, and plant flowers in the spring. Owning a home is a blessing. This is Ralph, our 12-year-old rabbit. He is has quite the personality. He is... Um, He's definitely getting up there in bunny years. He still has his curious, mischievous, <laughs> <laughs> and loving personality. We just absolutely adore this little guy, and we can't wait for our child to pet and play with him. Our story began in 2000 in Columbus, Ohio. Amy saw me first when I walked into her store to see a friend, which happened to also be her coworker. She told my friend that I was handsome and she had to meet me. Later that night, I got together with friends and Amy was there. I was immediately attracted to her. She was beautiful and her eyes shined with a passion for life. We instantly clicked. It seemed like we had known each other for years. We discovered we had so much in common. We knew that we wanted to spend the rest of our lives together. We were engaged in 2002 and married on August 2, 2003, the best day of our lives. Amy is a very creative person, and it shows in one of her favorite activities, making personalized greeting cards. Our friends and family enjoy receiving cards with her words and beautiful pictures of landscape and flowers. She makes others always feel very special. Amy loves to cook and makes so many fantastic dishes. She tries to find foods that are both tasty and healthy. I've even learned to do some cooking with her assistance. My personal favorites are her chili and meatloaf. She sure knows how to keep my stomach full. Mike is the fastest book reader that I've ever known. His passion is reading books about history, presidents, and especially the Civil War. Right now, he's engulfed in the book Truman. Mike is involved in a bowling league with several co-workers. He really enjoys the challenge and has been bowling for five years with his team. He's gradually gotten very good at it. I went to the bowling alley myself one day and surprised him with a new bowling ball, shoes, and a bag to put it all in. He was so excited to get all of this. This is just a little bit about us. We thank you so much for taking the time to view our video. Thank you.